Oh, poops. <coughs> oh, carnage. Hey, baby. People have been asking me about the pups, how they're getting on. And it's, uh, oh, yes. It's been a bit, uh, yeah, well, there they are. <laughs> the uh, darker coloured one now, but they've just been to the vet. And uh, there you go. Had, to the, had the tails docked and due claws, um, front due claws off. Yes, Pip. <laughs> yes, I'm showing people your puppy. So, anyway, it was a little bag of wriggliness. So, it's, she had her tail docked. There you go. There you go. Put it back there. Let's have a look at the other one. This little one. This little one. She's had hers done as well. And uh, due claws, but she's struggling a little bit. This one, so I'm not um, not holding out much hope for this one. To be fair, unfortunately, I'm just going to feed her. I've been sort of giving them supplement supplementary feeding. As uh, well, it's all gone a bit. Yeah. You clean her up, Pip. It's all gone a bit, uh, yeah, sideways, shall we say. But Pip's got a, a uterus infection now caused by one of the, well, the dead pup that was in, she had a dead pup inside her, um, which had gone, literally gone off. It was um, rather unpleasant. Anyway, that's caused uh, an issue all the way through. Killed quite a few pups. But these two left alive. This other one's struggling for oxygen now. You can see her struggling. But well, I'll get her some more food down her neck in a minute. Here, Pip, you stimulate this one. Stimulate that one. Give her one. Clean. Um, yes, yeah, I'm not. Look, don't hold out much hope for the one she's cleaning now. But uh, the vet did a tail. They, they just had a. They've had to have antibiotics, the pups, just to uh, give them a kick start. So, and unfortunately, Pip might have to go for an emergency spay because this uterus infection. She's in a bloody cardboard box. I had to cobble together at freaking two o'clock this morning. She was fretting that much. I've been keeping the, the pups away from her. Keep that one warm. Stick that under your neck. Keep it warm, you dickhead. Um, yeah, I've been keeping the pups away from her and only sort of allowing them on her for a bit to, to top up with the milk and whatnot. But she was fretting that much. Well, she's uh, very hot. She's running a temperature with infection, so uh, she's had um, antibiotic jabs, etc. Just now. Just move that back a little bit. Yeah, so people have been asking how they were. Well, there you go. <laughs> I'm not sure how many updates I can do with them. But uh, there's going to be plenty of trips to the vet and big vet bills here, there and everywhere. So, <laughs> watch the adverts. <laughs> well, yeah, so, anyway, what can you do? It's one of those things, it's, I don't know, not a lot I can do about it. it it's just been an absolute friggin' nightmare. I hardly slept in days of up. Well, I say up. I'm awake all the time, basically. Been awake. Well, I think I did get a couple hours kicked the other day, but <clears throat> been, I mean, what day is it today? Thursday. Pretty much been awake since Saturday trying to deal with this. And some of the some of the birthing procedure was absolutely shocking. But anyway, I've had to get some more vet bed. Oh, well, that one needs changing again now. It's a right friggin' mess again already. <laughs> but anyway, what can you do? <coughs> so yeah, so for people who were asking, people who were wondering how the pups were getting on, well, this is it. Um, and to be honest, even the vet, she was looking at them, she said, well, if they survive to the six week old to be microchipped, she said, I'd be surprised. <laughs> so that's, uh, yeah. 
so that's never <laughs> never a good thing. But what can you do? What can you do? We'll see what happens to these. Uh, I've literally come back from the vet about five, ten minutes ago, if that. And uh, actually, yeah, I've come in, put them in there, put them out, out of the box for Pip to clean in, to clean up. Made myself a broom and I thought, well, I'll just do a little, uh, a little video and see if, I don't know, answer a few questions for people. <laughs> How are you pups doing? How's Pip doing? But oh, I'm getting uh, loads of loads of messages through Messenger and whatnot. But uh, yeah, unfortunately, it's not massively happy news. But well, hey ho, what can you do? Pip will never have pups again anyway. By the looks of it, her uterus is knackered. So uh, she's probably going to have to go and uh, be spayed soon. But well, obviously. She, she can't be done just yet. Well, she might have to be, but um, you know we have to go see what the, what happens with the pups first. If the pups survive, if I can if I can get them through to ten days, they're three days old today. So if we can get them through to ten days, I'll be a little bit more hopeful. I suppose. I can, uh, well, they're so small, you know, but. Um, they were feeding yesterday. They were feeding really well from Pip, and yeah, then that little uh, the, the darker coloured one, or what, the one with the darker the darker markings. The uh, uh, well, yeah, it's the closest in, closest to the screen now. Not the one with the little fatty that's wriggling. That one's eating well. It's feeding well. That one. Um, <laughs> oops, but I wonder. <laughs> That one seems healthy you know? It looks a bit like Spot, that one. God help it. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> it seems to, well... I'm actually surprised the older one's still alive this morning, although it's gasping now. It's, it doesn't seem to be able to get any oxygen in, but I'll get it in the towel again in a minute. I'll, I'll give it a bit more food, a bit more milk. And uh, see how we go from there, really. And then, well, we shall see. We shall see. Who we pick? Good girl. You, you poser. <laughs> she's panting. She's running the temperature. She's in quite a, quite a high temperature. But she's just had um, calcium um, calcium jabs and uh, antibiotics and um, an, well, an examination which is sort of showing the uterus is not not in the best of shape so yeah so the vet seems to think it's something it'll, it'll have stemmed from the um, from the dead one but it, there was a, a pup half formed and it was dead and it was rotten. It was the first one out and it, oh my God. I've got a strong stomach, but I thought, oh, that stunk. <laughs> it was very unpleasant. And from that moment on, I thought, here we go. This is gonna be uh, fun, you know what we say. But hey ho, right, I shall get them fed and uh, that's um, yeah, that's all I can say at the moment. Really, the, they've made it to the the tail docking stage. Due, the doctor due for now. If they make it to the microchipping stage, well, it's going to be anyone's guess. I'm not 100 percent sure that that dark coloured or darker one is going to uh, make it by the end of the day. The vet wasn't very hopeful with that one, but she gave it a go. Fair do to the vet. So, um, they did the the docking and team claws and whatnot, and she's only charged me for one pup because she said, "Well, I'd be surprised if you get more than <laughs> if you get one, you know, get them both." But uh, <laughs> anyway, we'll see. We shall see. <clears throat>
bit gutting, but hey, what can you do? Well, we've done everything, we've done everything we could have done. It's just one of them things. So shit had gone wrong that you couldn't, you just didn't know. You just you couldn't tell. But uh, I shall fix this bit of a bed up again for her. I'll, uh, I may even put it back in the crate, and uh, she can stay in the crate with them. I think. I shall board it all up and what make it warm. Get a heat lamp in there and. See how we get on. Christ, I've been waffling for about 10 minutes already. But anyway, yeah, so all good fun, apparently. Vet bills and. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely stuff. The joys of owning dogs, eh? Well, hey ho. What can you do? What can you do? Anyways, thanks for having a look. Um, if you've got any questions or anything, just pop them in the comments. And I should get back to you at my earliest convenience. But well, I'm not doing much on social media or anything at the moment. I'm just uh, looking, you know, having a little, oh God, I'm cramping my back. Um, yeah, I'm just having a, a little looky now and again while I'm uh, in the process of dealing with these. I'm trying to grab an hour's kip when I can. <laughs> because obviously, I've got other dogs to deal with as well. Hang on. Oh shit. A little spot and gem out there. And the chicken pen. <laughs> Wave spot, you little shit. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, I've got them two to deal with. And you can hear Tyson practicing for his choir in the background. Noisy git. Anyway, right, pup date number one. I did have a, I did have a nice little video put together when she was giving birth. It was great. It was like, oh, hey, don't kick that one in the head, you gorgeous git. Um, yeah, it was like, oh, it is pup number one, just been born, blah de blah. And uh, I was having a nice little video put together. If you're gonna sit on it, God, she's clumsy. Um, yeah, nice little video put together, all the pups being born, not the actual birth, because the new YouTuber <laughs> freak out. But, uh, you know, they literally the two seconds after being born, and, you know, the dog, uh, the bitch cleaning her up, and, you know, all the nicey nicey stuff. And then they all died, so I thought, well, yeah, it's a bit inappropriate probably putting that on to say, oh, look at all my lovely puppies, blah, blah, blah. Oh, by the way, they're all dead. So, uh, yeah. We didn't want to do that so uh, <laughs> anyway um, <laughs> yeah unfortunately it would have been quite a nice little video but anyway I just deleted it all and got rid of it so well I don't want to be reminded of all that myself so <laughs> I don't mind anyone else watching going oh lovely lovely puppies and uh, yeah I'm in a freaking bin bag and they pep. Yes. You know, pack up their fags. Smoke too much. <laughs> right. <coughs> Same with me. Right, I shall get them fed, get them sorted, get them bedded down for a couple of hours, and get the Uber jobs done. Can we, Pip? Yes. <laughs> sorted. Right. Thanks for having a look. I'll catch you later. Cheers, peeps.